Ah, June. That magical month where all of you summer people get your wish, and the season of fun and sun begins. It's also the start of hurricane season, and with that comes need for preparation. The Queen Anne's County Government and the Department of Emergency Services wants to share their Know Your Zone campaign to help you be better prepared in case of emergency. This campaign is designed to educate residents of Maryland to know what areas are subject to tidal flooding and bringing awareness to evacuation zones. The state of Maryland has made it as easy as ABC. These are the areas that are the most likely to be impacted by severe flooding in the event of a major storm or hurricane. The Queen Anne's County Department of Emergency Services has made it easy for its residents to find their evacuation zone. Go online today and check it out. It only takes a couple of seconds to find your zone and educate yourself to know exactly where your home, business, and other family members are located to always make sure you're prepared. So I'm standing here in Y Mills, pretty much right on the border between Queen Anne's County and Talbot County. So you'd think being this far away from the water and the Chesapeake Bay that I'd be safe, right? Nope. I'm still technically in a zone. This is technically in zone C. Zone C means that you still need to pay attention to warnings and notices when a hurricane hits our state. So I'm here in Prospect Bay in Graysonville, which is almost dead set in the center of zone B. Now zone B is not as bad as zone A, but remember, if you're in any of the zones, either A, B, or C, you are still in danger. So always heed warnings and notices. I'm standing here in downtown Stevensville on Kent Island. Why am I standing here? To let you know that Stevensville and Kent Island is directly in zone A. What is zone A? Zone A is a part of Queen Anne's County that is gonna be affected the most when we have hurricanes or severe tidal flooding that will hit this area during the hurricane season. Let's go through a quick checklist that you, the residents of Queen Anne's County, should follow if there is a hurricane that threatens our area. One, build an emergency supply kit with food, tools, medical needs, clothing, etc. Two, develop a family emergency plan, a communication plan, and action plans in case of emergency. Three, always remember to plan for your fur family members as well. Four, stay tuned to trusted sources such as the National Weather Service and local broadcasters during severe weather conditions. Five, stay indoors and away from windows. Six, fill a bathtub or other large containers with water. And finally, seven, keep all of your important documents safe. Thanks for watching. Now, check out the website below and in the link to find your zone and help spread the word so everyone else can be as prepared as you.